The rising cost of commuting is taking a toll on the wallets of many VCU students. Gas prices are up and parking can be expensive. Some commuter students are still adjusting to the increase in cost. If you think about how much money I've spent on transportation for the entire time that I've been here, as far as uh, my general life, right now it's not affecting it too badly. But I guess we'll see what happens in the next year. The Richmond Metropolitan Authority oversees many of the local tolls. They recently announced a toll rate increase of 20 cents for the Downtown Expressway and Poe White Parkway. When this increase takes effect in September, it will cost 70 cents for a two-axle vehicle to pass through a toll. We contacted the RMA to find out if they intend to offer discount toll rates to college students. The RMA stated, we do not offer discounts to college students who use Easy Pass or pay cash along our toll roads. A student who commutes to class five days a week will spend $112 on tolls each semester. That's $32 more per semester than before the toll increase. For many students, every penny counts. The more it goes up, the less gas I put in my car every time, because I just put 20 in every time I go to the gas station. I've, I've avoided the parking deck altogether ever since they started putting the, making the rates go up. A student parking pass to one of VCU's commuter parking decks costs $160 per semester. VCU commuters see the cost of getting to class as just another speed bump, slowing them down on the road to a college education. For VCU Insight, I'm Scott Kennedy.